Uh, let's stretch out our ankles a bit and uh, start rolling our ankles. Start with one side. Just make a circle with your toes. Throw that circle in the air. Stretch it out. Ooh, we got some clicks and cracks and change to the other way. Good, change legs to the other side. Man, it is windy here. Change the other direction. Good, now uh, let's shake out our first leg from the hip all the way down, nice and loose. And then isolate the lower leg, shake out that ankle and foot. Just let it flop around, practice not controlling it. And then on the other side, shake the whole leg out, get rid of any tension. And then isolate the lower leg, just flop that foot around a bit. Good, shake everything out, get nice and loose. We're gonna start with nerves. So if you remember nerves, we're uh, gonna stabilize the whole leg, and just use our foot and ankle to get warmed up a bit. We'll start with singles, so just one, then we'll do two, one, two, hold, then we'll do three, one, two, three, one, two, three, and then four. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Just practicing getting control over, over our feet, tapping just with the toe tap. And let's try it. Good old fruit cream sauce. in, making sure you guys can hear me okay, hearing the music. Everything good? Yeah. All right, cool. Um, all right, so we're going to jump right in um, into some follow the leader kind of stuff, and we'll do steps and stamps and stomps. We'll do some hops and leaps, uh, maybe some heel digs and toe stabs, just to remind you what all those things are. Um, and it's time to take off the sweater because it's hot. Um, 
All right, so steps right underneath ourselves, changing weight on the ball of our feet, stamps, the whole foot, changing weight every time, stomps, the whole foot not changing weight, picking it right back up again, uh, hops, leaving the ground, staying on the same side, the alternative, if you don't want to hop, is just a heel, leap, changing feet, leaving the, leaving the ground. The alternate, if you want to not jump off the ground, is just a step. Uh, heel digs, taking the corner of our heel, digging it into the ground. We usually do heel step, heel step, heel step. And the alternate to that is a toe stab. So taking our foot, stabbing it into the ground, a little bit on the diagonal behind ourselves. And we usually do stab, step, stab, step. Um, some other things we might do today, we might lift our toes off the ground, so leaving your heel on the ground, raising your toe off, uh, you can kind of use your body to help you do that by kind of sticking your butt out and taking your upper body forward, and then heels, just like that. So let's give some of those a shot, just follow the leader. Question so far, quickly before we move on, just making sure. Anything? Hi, Peter. Hi. <laughs> uh, 
We're okay, let's uh, let's move on. Let's do some. Let's do brush steps, and we'll do a new thing today called scuffs. So, um, starting with our right leg, we're going to practice brush steps. So, brush. We're swinging forward. We're using the toe tap. Brush, brush, brush. If we add a step, brush. You could travel forward with this, but in our living room world, we are going to stay in place. So let's try that, starting with the right leg. Five, six, seven, eight. Brush. Try backwards, preparing to the front. Brush. We'll do that both directions, um, and then we'll change it into, actually before we change it into a flap, let's do this. We're going to do something called a scuff. It's the same thing as the brush, except this time, instead of the toe tap going forward, you're going to hit your heel on the ground going forward. So let's try that a bit. So right, step, left, step, brush, I'm sorry, scuff, step, scuff, step, scuff, step, scuff, step. Your foot is flexed. Good. We'll do that forward. We won't do it back because it's just weird and you'll, you'll hurt your form. Um, okay, so we'll do that with the music and then we'll change our brush step into a flap. So remember your flap is going straight into the floor. I don't want to see up and then down. You should be going down, right into the floor. So let's try that starting with the right foot. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We'll add a heel. We'll add heel, heel. And we'll do both of those backwards. So preparing to the front, just with the flap without the heel. So lap, so lap. before we try it with the music. Is everybody good with that? Okay, let's try it with music. Nice and slow. Start with brush steps.
running flats. Um, and we ran out of time in the routine, so we didn't get to put it in. But we're going to put it in today. So um, let's try running flaps. Running flaps are just flaps, back to back. But it's going to feel a little bit more like you're down in place. Let me unmute you. Everybody still with me? Yes. <laughs> Getting a little cardio today. Yeah. Okay. One leg isn't um, happy. What's that? One leg isn't happy. Oh. Uh oh. <laughs> okay. Um, all right. Well, let's move on. Uh, so that's it for flaps. Let's do some shuffles now. So, shuffles, you're going to brush forward and you're going to brush back. You're going to put them together to make the shuffle. So right leg, brush forward, brush back, forward, back, forward, back, forward, back. Try it on the other leg, forward and back, forward, back, forward, back, forward, back. Um, so when you're slow, you can do it with a swingy motion. When you speed it up, it's going to be a little bit more down and up. You're going to use your ankle, uh, and if you if you think about using your hip to push your leg down, if you leave your foot relaxed, that up and down motion can do some of the work for you. So you're not controlling that foot so much, you're letting it be a little bit loose. Um, so let's do some shuffles. We'll do shuffles to the front, side, back, and side um, on both sides. And then we'll do some faster shuffles on one side only, then the other side, and then we'll do shuffle step. Thank you. 
Now, you know what's coming next. We're going to take it faster. So now we're going to go. How's everybody doing? Okay. Good. Questions? Good. No. <laughs> okay. Um, we're going to do one other thing that I forgot. Um, 
we're going to do shuffle hop step, which I think we did a couple weeks ago. It's not last week. But we're going to do a shuffle on the right, step, hop on the left leg or heel, you don't want to jump, and then step. So let's try that. Right leg, shuffle, hop, step. Then you're on the other side. Try that again on the right. Starting on the right. space. Sometimes we cross this in front and it becomes something called an Irish. So it's the shuffles out to the side a little bit more. We hop and cross in front and then we can travel forward with it. Um, we're not going to do that now though because we're, we're short on space. But let's try it um, with some music. Nice and slow. Very slow. <laughs> questions okay just silence all right grab a sip of water if you want we're gonna do a little sequence next um, and the only thing I'm gonna say about the sequence is the hardest part is right in the beginning so <laughs> don't get frustrated because after that is all downhill all right so this sequence starts with that scuff that you guys practiced in the beginning. So we're gonna start with our right foot and we're gonna do a scuff and we're gonna bring it around. We're gonna make this whole circle scuff like that. So try that with your right leg, scuff. Again, scuff. Again, good. Try it with your left leg while we're here. Scuff and around, scuff and scuff. Um, I think my, my standing leg a little bit to kind of get low enough to get that stuff on the ground. If you're, if you're uh, standing up straight, you might notice that you're missing it a lot. It's much easier to get a good stuff in um, all the way down into the floor if you bend your leg. So we're going to do stuff heel or stuff hop. So it's your choice whether you do the heel or the hop. But it's going to be stuff hop or heel. So try that. Stuff hop. Stuff hop. From here, your right leg is in the air. You're going to do a back flap. Back flap. So try that starting from the side. Back flap. Back flap. If we add it on to the scuff, we have scuff, hop, back flap. Let's try it starting on the right leg. Five, six, seven, eight. Scuff, hop, back flap. Good. Try again. Five, six, seven, eight. Yeah. Yes, okay. Stop. Set. Let's add that on. 
Sure you haven't left me. <laughs> All right. Is Get everybody it. everybody still go okay? Still here. <laughs> <laughs> here, but maybe not okay. Okay, interesting. Um, okay. Let's let's do this. Um, there's more to the pattern before it repeats on the left. So um, let's try this. Let's add on the rest so that we can get the music. Um, so after this. We're going to do this. Uh, wait a minute. Let me just double check. Make sure I know. Oh, yeah. So we are right legs free. We're going to do this. Step out. So 
heel. Out, in, toe, heel. I told you it was going to be easy. So take your right leg, go out, in, step, heel. Out, in, step, heel. Let me mute you for a second. Let's start this again on the right side. Five, six, seven, eight. And then we'll try it with music. I'll scream out. Hopefully you can hear me. I'll scream out the, the order. Anybody have any questions? Okay. Let's give it a shot then with the music. Okay. This is a Louis Jordan song. Alright, let's walk through it 
that music one time, the whole thing through, now that you know what the music sounds like, okay? Um, it'll be faster than that in a minute. Uh, starting with the right leg, here we go. Five, six, five, six, seven, eight, stop. Yes, that the first part is probably the sticky part for most people. Am I right? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yes. Let's do it. Uh, again. Yes. Let's do it. Let's go over that first part again. Okay. So starting with the scuff, scuff on the right. Scuff. Or is it just remembering or? I just need to repeat that a couple more times. A couple more times? Okay. <laughs> Let's do it. A couple more times. Let's try it on the right first. Five, six, five, six, seven, eight. Alright, let's 
say the speed of a knot. Of that beginning part help at all you guys a little bit I just have to practice it like a hundred more times yeah um, I can give you a simplified version too like if you're having trouble holding on to some of those details um, you can do a simplified version um, so you could do and a simple clap you just do step, step. you do So don't worry about it. Um, let's see, what we're gonna let's add the next part because you guys, the next part is gonna be so easy for you. Um, so we practiced running flaps today. We're gonna do that pattern that you practiced. One, two, three. One, two, three. Except for instead of holding on that third one, you're gonna do a heel, which to me is a lot easier because um, you can actually put your weight down instead of trying to balance. So we're gonna do one, two. Let's 
one more time. Five, six, and five, six, seven, eight. Can I clarify anything? Okay. <laughs> Nothing. The worst thing is silence. <laughs> I just, I think you've all died. <laughs> or you hate everything about this hour. <laughs> okay, let's try the whole thing with music. A lot of concentration. It's a lot of concentration, yeah, I know. It's a lot to ask for 10.55 in the morning, but you can do it. All right, let's give it a shot with music, whole thing. together. So uh, let's try this. We're going to do one, two, 
Besides stuff like that where there's transitions. No. Okay. Let's try it again with the music then. Let's do the slower version and then eventually we're going to get to the fast version. Here we go. Thank you. 
guys. Good job. Um, I hope you weren't too frustrated. <laughs> Hopefully you all made it through. Um, next week, we'll go back to the beginning. The routine will be much slower. Be super easy for anybody who wants to join us new. Um, tell your friends. And uh, like I said, after class, I'll do a little extra credit uh, pattern if anybody wants to stay after for, I don't know, a few minutes, 10 minutes, something like that.